But the Paleo Hebrew of the Lord is <clears throat> our Lord and Savior's real name, true name, and the Hebrew, uh, who we call Jesus of Christ today. So we definitely have to return to the Lord, Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shah, and his name if we want to be saved in the last days. Okay. A lot of us still leaning on our own understanding. We still not uh, uh, listening and hearkening to the voice of the Lord. And, and, and this is why the Lord said, you know, we have removed, or uh, I'm say we, uh, y'all, you know, they have removed their hearts far from me. Okay. Because, you know, uh, the troops is going out in the last days. The great awakenings is happening during these times. And some of our people, uh, uh, it's not, it's not getting it, but through the spirit, through the scriptures, we understand why, you know, it's the Lord's doing, <clears throat> okay, so, uh, let's start at, uh, 29, and we'll go to, uh, start at, um, uh, it says, moreover, the multitude of thy strangers shall be like small dust, and dust in the scriptures represents uh, confusion. And the multitude of the terrible ones shall be as shall that pass away, yea, it shall be as an instant suddenly. Thou shalt be visited of the Lord of hosts with thunder, with earthquake, and great noise, and with great noise. Salaki. with storm and tempest and the flames of divine power and the multitude of all the nations that fight against Ariel even all that fight against her and her munition and, and that depressed I'm sorry and that distressed her shall be as a dream of a night vision see that so as I was saying you know uh, all the, the most high uh, is coming back with, with storm tempest defying power is divine fire, fire sorry it's like and, and he's coming back you know with, with uh, 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 earthquake you know uh, and, and, and the noise he's talking about is coming from these missiles okay you know this, this prophesies for the for the world to go out and fight, okay. And the fire is gonna come from the uh, ICBM, uh, those missiles, okay. So this is how the world gonna end in order for us to be saved. You know, uh, we have to be uh, in the truth that Yahweh Bashem Yahweh shall. It says, "For the Lord had." Let's jump down to verse ten. It says, "For the Lord had poured out upon you the spirit of deep sleep." And had closed your eyes that the prophets and your rulers, the seers, had he covered. So this is why our rulers is, 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 is confused and don't know what time it is. And don't know, you know, uh, uh, don't know <clears throat> the scriptures or understand what the scriptures are saying. Okay, because the Lord had blinded the minds of, of, of certain individuals. Okay, so this is why a lot of us can't understand the, the scriptures, because it's the spirit of deep sleep he poured out. Okay, so let's read verse 10 again. It says, For the Lord had poured out upon you the spirit of deep sleep, and had closed your eyes, the prophets and your rulers, the seers, had he covered. And this is why a lot of your Christian uh, pastors can't understand the scriptures. Okay. Because the Lord has them in a day. And he can uh, have them in that deep sleep until the day of judgment. See that? So we got to uh, know where we're at in these scriptures and know uh, and be lead or led and, and taught by uh, the, the right camps. Okay. And the vision, that's verse 11 says, And the vision of all is become unto you as the words of a book that is sealed, which men deliver 
to one that is learned, saying, Read this, I pray thee. And he said, I cannot, for it is sealed. And the book is delivered to him that is not learned, saying, Read this, I pray thee. And he said, I am not learned. See that so so a lot of us just can't understand the scripture no matter how you break it down, or how you put it, you know we still can't understand what's going on, and it's the Lord's doing. You know it's nothing that you know, uh, uh, it's nothing that you know we can do to 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 uncover, uh, open the eyes of the people. You know it has to be the Lord you hold by you and how to do that. Okay, I mean you can lead the people, but it has to be the Lord. To actually put the spirit in them to believe and have faith in the truth. And say, Wherefore the Lord Yahweh Bashem Hawasha said, For as much as this people draw near me with their mouth and with their lips, do honor me, but have removed their hearts far from me. See, so the mind of the people is far from Yahweh Bashem Hawasha. Okay. No matter how we tell the people the Lord name is not this, not uh, that, you know, they're going to give you their own understanding of what it is. So, you know, these people are, uh, has the, 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 uh, the spirit of sleep on them. They say, but, I'm sorry, I said like, they say, and they're Fear toward me is taught by the precept of men. Therefore, behold, I will proceed to do a marvelous work among this people. I'm talking about the, the elect of the twelve tribes of Israel. Even a marvel a marvelous work, and they wonder, for the wisdom of their wise men shall perish, and the understanding of their prudent men shall be hid. See that? So it, the world cannot receive this knowledge, man. You know, just just quoting the scripture, you know. And, and only elect uh, a remnant of the people is going to return. Not a whole bunch, okay? Only a small group, a small remnant of the people is going to return to Yahweh Bashem Hawashah. So you have to have faith and believe. What you're hearing is the truth. And, you know, seek the Lord yourself. So that you be uh, saved under the name in these last days from the fire and all the destruction that's coming. Okay, because Jacob's trouble is coming. Uh, uh, you know, the scripture says it's going to be, you know, uh, uh, things done on the earth that uh, has not been done. So we got to make sure, you know, uh, we we we. Uh, you got to make sure that you you're under the truth, and not calling on these idol gods or fake gods, false gods. Okay. Let's go to First John. And three and uh, five. Three and five says. And ye know, I'm sorry. Uh, three and seven. It says, "Little children, let no man deceive you. He that doeth righteousness is righteous, even as he is righteous." See that? It says, "He that committed sin is of the devil, for the devil sinned from the beginning. For thus purpose the Son of God, Yahweh Power." was manifested that he might destroy the works of the devil. Okay, and this is what the Lord, Yahweh Bashem Yahweh is coming to do in the last days. He's coming to destroy all the works of the devil. Okay, and all those who's believing and falling after the, the devil, he, that he's going to, you know, you're going to catch that, 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 that flaming fire. Okay, so it's not a time to be out here playing around, man. You know, this, this word is going out, the truth is going out. And you got, uh, you, you got to 
have understanding of the scriptures in order for you to have hope and faith in your whole by shame and whole shot. And that starts with fearing the Lord. And a lot of us don't fear the Lord. Okay? Because we think the, uh, the Lord is just all love. But the, but the scriptures, uh, according to the scriptures, you know, the Lord is not all love. Okay, so the Lord, he's, he, 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 he heals, kills, and destroys. So, I want to share that with you guys today. I'll be back with the next one, Lord willing. Uh, peace.